If you look over here on the left-hand side, you'll see a bunch of icons. The one we're interested in looks like four squares grouped together. Go ahead and click on that. This is where you can find and install all sorts of extensions to enhance your coding experience. Just click on the search bar and start typing Live Server. As you type, you'll see it pop up in the results below. It should be the first one on the list. Once you see it, click on the Install button. It'll take just a moment to install, and once it's done, you're ready to go. I'll type a sample HTML code. Now, with our HTML file open in the editor, we want to see how it looks in the browser. To do that, simply right-click anywhere inside the editor and select Open with Live Server from the context menu. This will instantly launch your file in your default web browser. Now, here's the best part. Any changes you make to the code will automatically refresh in the browser. You can see your updates in real time. For example, if I change this heading from Home to my first web page, you can see the update happen instantly. On the left side, you can see the live server output in the browser, and on the right side, I'm changing the code. Super convenient, right? And that's how you set up VS Code for web development with live server.